Hey y'all, hey y'all, Bunkle here with another pack opening uh, from that big old box that I found in the back of the garage. That mystery box that just keeps up, keeps on turning up uh, a lot of great stuff, I'd say. Uh, if you watch the other videos, check out the earlier videos on, on my channel here. Uh, you'll definitely see it. To me, it's a, it's a lot of big hits, all junk wax. Okay, now that's one thing to keep in mind. Uh, this one right here, it's a 1991 Jumbo, and I only have one of these. Um, the cool thing about this, of course, you could win one million dollars in their sweepstake, or that's the total prize value. Now, in the 91 set, of course, you have the Chipper Jones rookie, uh, Craig Biggio. The tough card to find, it's an error card, uh, it's a Mark Whiten. Now, he didn't really have all that much of a notable career, uh, but his hand is kind of over the border. All right, uh, there's also an error on a McGuire card, a Mattingly card, uh, Chris Hoyles. Um, and the, the Dave Winfield in, is another card that even in a PSA 9 goes for a decent penny. So anyway, I hope y'all had a great day so far before joining me here. And I definitely hope you enjoy this. Let's get started on this pack here. Now, got the handy dandy box cutter going on again. Got to be real careful opening these. And I'm just going to do a quick adjustment here. It looks like my hands are a lot bigger than usual. All right. Got to be real careful getting those out. Now, again, I'm just going to be opening this one jumbo, good jumbo pack from 91 here. And we start off with Scott Champarino. Now, this is what the fronts look like. Now I'm not I'm not thrilled with the uh the actual design here because the name the way the name is uh with the black and colors and all of that for a lot of the names it's not all that easy to read. Now the I guess the one that we'd be one of the ones that we'd be looking for the Chris Hoyles. If you notice this red frame here on the error card it's a white frame. So if we see it well then great. All right. Got a mark New Newfield, yep, Mark Newfield, Tom Browning, Brad Arenberg. All right, we got a record breaker, 1990 record breaker. The Miss Q on the grounder ends the streak of 95 consecutive errorless games by Cal Ripken. To me, that's definitely a keeper card. Dennis Lamp, Shane Andrews, number one draft pick. Shows you not everyone number draft pick goes on to being that major star. All right, we got Bob Ducey, Moises Alou. All right, we have a bit of a card flip here. Let's get those the correct way again. Alfredo Griffin, Randy Veras with the Brewers, Kevin Reamer, Dave Island, Devon White, Jim Leland. Mark Lee, and we got another flip going on. Mark Salas, Stan Javier, Ernie Riles, Paul Assenmacher, whoop, Paul O'Neill. All right, and that's deep into his career. It's a couple of years before he went to the Yanks. Sid Bream, Rick Miller, Gary Gaetti, Doc Gooden. Nice card, nice action shot of him there. I remember just hanging outside on the 7 train line, trying to get a peep in when I was a late teenager. Could not get a ticket whenever Gooden was pitching, uh, especially going back to the uh, to his rookie season uh, back in, was it 84, 85? Uh, rookie, and then uh, after that, Games were always sold out, but there was a little niche on the 7 train station. If you were standing right there, you could see straight through the home plate. New York secret, you know? All right, we got Chris Basio, Mike Benjamin, Terry Schumpert, Rick Parker, Francisco Oliveras, Jason Grimsley, Chris James, Chris James, Edgar Diaz, Franklin Stubbs, Jeff Torborg, manager card. Got the future star, Lance Dixon. I guess not. 
All right, and that's another one. I mean, to me, that's barely legible. I don't know. Maybe your eyes are a whole lot better than mine, but I'll flip it over, and that's Bill Swift. You got Raphael Palmero there, Chet Lemon, Kevin McReynolds, Art Howe. That's their propaganda piece for the instant win game. Marty Clary. Real nice. Delino De Shields, that gold cup card. I'll keep that one on the side. Davey jo Dave Johnson. Not Davey Johnson, Dave Johnson. Donnie Hill. Roger Craig. Glenn Wilson. Spike Owen. Kelly Gruber. And Wally Backman. Definitely not all that much in that half of the pack to write home about. Maybe this side's going to be a bit better. Get the trash on the side there. There goes our 30-year-old piece of crunched up gum. 30 plus years right now. All right. Now, just looking at this, this definitely, I, I'm... I hope that there's some good guards in here, but I don't know if you can see what I see, but that looks like a solid kind of a niche, a tear down the side of this stack right here. So that right there, if any of these are one of the, I guess, hit cards, uh, it'd be pretty sad because it definitely won't be a 10. Got Al Leiter, the Barry Larkin All-Star, Alice Burks, Juan Gonzo Gonzalez, Doug Drabeck, Tim Sherrill. All right, got another flip going on there. Larry Cassian, Brett Main, Andres Thomas, Lance Blankenship, Tim Nering, Brian Barnes, Future Star. I guess in the very, 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 very distant future. Chris Carpenter, Chris Hammond. All right. And this is a, I'm glad, I'm very glad that's not a major car. A nasty little tear out of the top of that one. Wonder if this pack is like of a seconds or something. Kevin Tappany, Al Newman, Lloyd Mosby, Danny Gladden, Wes Gardner, Pete Smith. Randy Tomlin, Dave Winfield. All right, now that's the Winfield. And that one actually appears to be a card that's passed where all that niche was. I'll take a glass to the corners there, but that looks really sharp. Now, I'm not sure why this is so tough in a, even in a PSA 9. Uh, this might actually be one. The centering there is really spot on. I'll be measuring that out later. And like I say, taking a magnifying glass to the corners and the edges just to make sure. But that one right there looks like a winner card. Got Mark Icorn. You know what? I'm going to even take a second and put that one in a quick case. Want to keep that one protected before I even put it under. All right. going to be a ways out there. All right, we got Gene Larkin, Rick Sutcliffe, Dick Schofeld, Keith Miller, Nick Isaski, Mookie Wilson, when he moved on to the Jays, Jose Offerman, future star, Tim Tom Brookins, Bob Murphy, Kirk Gibson, John Dobson, Mike Devereaux, Glavin card, Hall of Famer there for you. Definitely a keeper. Les Lancaster. Now, again, that name I just really couldn't get there. Mark Portugal, Jerry Don Gleaton, Sam Horn. He was supposed to be a major slugger. Didn't exactly pan out that way. I mean, he's even got the muscle pose going on there. Phil Bradley. Tim Jones. Andy Bennis. Nick Leva, manager for the Phillies at that time. 
Don Zimmer when he was manager with the Cubs before he went on to Yankee greatness. Terry Pendleton, Cal Daniels, Joe Morgan, not that Joe Morgan, but Red Sox manager Joe Morgan, Rick Schrader, Schroeder, and Don Carmen. So that wraps it up for this one. I, I would say that out of the 100 card pack that this was, wasn't all that much that was really good. I mean, we did pull a Glavin, the Shields, the Gooden, and the Cal Ripken record breaker. Uh, best card out of the bunch, though, was that Dave Winfield. I'm going to take glass to it. Um, I'm not exactly sure why it's so tough on a PSA 9, because that one looks real sharp to me. Anyway. <clears throat> Hope you all had a good time watching this video. Pardon the cough there. Hope you had a good time watching this video, uh, just going through these memories or historical cards, uh, a little bit of chit-chat going on also here, uh, but hope y'all had a good time. Catch y'all soon. Make sure you like, give a thumbs up, subscribe, comment, let me know, all the good stuff, all that good stuff. Take care, bunkle out, stay blessed.